Near the small town of Cuero, Texas, Dr. Phyllis Canyon has witnessed a worrying series of killings on her ranch. In 2005, something strange attacked her chickens, drinking their blood. What was the most unusual is that each time we found a chicken dead, it was opened up anywhere in this throat area, uh, and it appeared that all the blood was out of it. I actually lost 28. All of them killed over months in the exact same fashion. I just did not know what it was. Dr. Canyon is a wildlife expert and has lived all her life on a ranch. She instantly knows this is not the work of a normal Texas predator. I had told all the neighbors, you know, if you ever see this animal, call me and let me know because I want to see it. I don't want to shoot it. We just really want to find out what it is. But it isn't a neighbor who gets first sight of this new predator. It's 2008, and police officer Brandon Riddle and his partner are on a routine patrol. We come down here and we turn a corner, and uh, as soon as we turn this corner looking for the down fence, we see something over here uh, just standing in the middle of the road and just didn't know what it was. What is that? My partner at the time, the, the lady that I was training, she uh, just goes, oh my God, what is that, what is that? Officer Riddle turns on his dashboard camera and captures the first images ever of this strange creature. What is this? Oh, man. We're just sitting there watching it just run, 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 and it was just a strange thing. He looks up and looks back at us. The creature has an unusually large muzzle, large protruding canine teeth, and bright blue eyes. Starting to come up this hill here, and then just takes off, and then came back up, and it ran up the road. It was just strange, it was just weird looking. So crazy is that? I patrolled these back roads here in Dewey County for about eight and a half years, and that's the first time I ever seen anything that looked like that. Officer Riddle films the creature only 25 miles from Dr. Canyon's ranch. Every time someone has some unidentified animal, the post-mortem analysis of it has proven to be it's a mangy coyote or sometimes a mangy fox. But Dr. Canyon is convinced she has a new species, stuffed and just waiting for science to catch up. This is the animal. It's bizarre. We've been all over the world and seen animals from all over the world, never seen anything like this. You know, it doesn't have any hair on it, but the whole body is covered with this slight layer of fuzz. And they say that there, you know, there's no such thing. It, it doesn't exist. And it's right here. 